Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. And Gia has been asked to go to the Western Watch Tower to help fight a dragon that attacked it. And she's a little hesitant. Hence the reason why she's walking to the door. The, the Jarl made a mention that, uh, Need something? I have more experience with dragons than anyone else. Uh, I literally investigated Helgen and saw a dragon fly off. So I really don't, I guess, <laughs> because I've seen a dragon up close, I've got a, all this experience. He is intent on letting people know about Talos. But reluctantly Gia is going to go help Damn those Irilis oblivion. They want to back the Check out this dragon. Oh, she's... She had said that they had, were meeting at the front gate. I don't see them. Oh, uh, maybe they're already... Oh, let's check the map. Where is this place? Okay, it's over here. Okay, here we go. time it is. Ah, lovely start to an evening. So it's a right down here at the crossroad. I don't see anything. just there at Bleak Falls Barrow. Oh, here they are. They did leave already. No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened. Hey, you're doing good, Captain Obvious. Around somewhere. Spread out and look for survivors. We need to know what we're feeling. Okay. You... Do no dragons fly. I hope you all have bows. Happened here? I don't know. Is it not obvious? Kinneret, save us. Here he comes again. Oh, he hello. Comes. Find cover and make every arrow count. How do we know it's a he? That's really not important right now. Oh. Oh, you're fast. 
Whoa. Not this is Tay Dragon. Oh. <laughs> uh, I think he is fighting back. Uh, yeah, I do. I miss. Oh. I only have twenty two arrows left. Somebody hit him hard. Ow, somebody's getting beat. Some oh. Get him, Elroth. How about girls? Is it really dead? I'll waste an arrow. Yes. What's happening? Everybody, get back. Hey, 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 what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What in the world? Oh, I can get stuff. Nah. I'll take those, though. And I'll take the steel arrows. I need them. Well. Uh. I can't believe it. You're Dragonborn. What? What do you mean? In the very oldest tales, back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. I There's have only no one idea. Way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragonborn. What do you mean, shout? Oh. Hey, it's that word that I learned. What are you talking about? Yeah, what are you That's talking right. about? My grandfather used to tell stories about the dragonborn. Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septim himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septim killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They are just coming back now for the first time in forever. <laughs> the old tales tell of the dragonborn who could kill dragons and steal their power. You must be one. What do you say, Yerleth? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Yerleth. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than 
flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. <laughs> I like you. Here's a dead dragon. Yes. And that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. If you really are dragonborn, like out of the old tales, you ought to be able to shout. Can you? Have you tried? Uh. She summons the thorn. Must be. You really are dragonborn, then. Okay. Okay, now it's getting awkward. Um. We taught that dragon not to mess with White Run, didn't we? Yeah, we did. Uh, earless, earless. I can't believe we actually killed a dragon. Yes, we actually did. I'm glad you're on our side. That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. I don't know about this dragonborn business, but I'm sure glad you're with us. You better get back to White Run right away. Yarl Bagra will want to know what happened here. Okay. Uh. That's two we lost. I'll leave you with everything else. Oh no, we lost three. I'll go back in a minute. Did we lose anyone else? Oh, these must be the other guards that were here. Well, at least we were able to save White Run from a dragon. To lose so many people. Oh no. Did we lose another one? No, that's rocks. I don't know what this dragonborn is, but that. But if dragons can be killed... Stop there and ponder for a moment. What in the world? Okay, that was a little spooky. What in the world? Well, <laughs> my life has kind of turned. I come to Skyrim to be working for a museum. Turn around and Helping out a city defend itself from a dragon to 
having this weird power. This, this is are not allowed here. Turn around and go back the way you came. We're causing no trouble. All we ask is to look for her. I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. Damn those gray mains to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks, they'll get what's coming to them. I think your concerns might be. The Greybeards have summoned the Dragonborn to hide Rothka. Such a thing has not happened for hundreds of years. Oh, so. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Well. Well, she is a priest. Priestess. Could you spare coin? So she may know a lot more history. You have the Jarl's confidence, friend. And so you have mine. Well, thank you. I'm hoping I can... Jarl, I am back. Good. You're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard the summons. What else could it mean? The Greybeards. Yeah. We were just talking about you. My brother needs a word with you. Okay. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Yes. I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. So it's true. The gray yeah. beards really were summoning you. All I know is I got whizzied by some mystical stuff and it really freaked me out. Who are the gray beards? Masters of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. Okay. What does that have to do with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thoom or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? Yes. That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rungar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as she may be, I don't Nord see any signs nonsense? of being this, what, dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed yes. up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. Yes, you it's did. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with her? That's the Greybeards business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? Uh, let's argue. Better get up to High Hrothgar immediately. There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. It's a tremendous honor. I envy you, you know, to climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? No, you're just telling High me. High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. Well, thank my you. Right is Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl. 
and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Thank you. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. Well. We've become Thane of Whiterun. Uh, who are you? Hello, Eros. We can never. Jarl has appointed me to be your house, Carl. It's an honor to serve you. The what Jarl does that mean? Recognized you as a person of great importance in the hold, a hero. The title of Thane is an honor, a gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way if you tell them who you are. As my Thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. That's good. But I don't own anything other than what's <laughs> I'm literally carrying. So, uh... Yeah. No, I'm not going to have you follow me right now. I am another wanderer here to lick my father's boots. Good job. You're rude. I need to go have a drink. Tired, friend. The Baron de Mere has beds for rent. Yes, I, I'm. I'm going for a drink and going to bed. This has been a weird, weird day. Damn those gray mains to oblivion. They want to back the storm cloaks. They'll get what's coming to them. Again, I think you need to. Uh, Reevaluate your uh you're finding the city in proper order, Thane. Yes, it is. Wow, word travels fast. Uh yeah. About that drink. anything. I think I got a clean mug around here somewhere. Well, maybe you should do dishes more often. Um, sit by the door here. Sadia, wake up there. Yes, mum. <sighs> you want a drink? What's on Depends. the menu? Are you thirsty, hungry, both? Your strongest. We have ale. Hunting brew mead. Nord mead. A bottle of wine. Thank you. Now, please, no more questions. I didn't ask you any. You a Oh, okay. Let's have... Curled leeks and some chicken. And a sweet roll. And we're drinking the whole bottle. 
So, people think I'm this dragonborn. A group or individual called the Greybeards have summoned me to High Rothgar, which, where is that? He said something about the throat of the world. I gotta climb a mountain. He did mention 7,000 steps. And I need to travel to a place called Everstead or Iverstead? Huh. Okay. Well, that is in the direction that I need to go to locate this sixth bell, ham bell hammer. Oh, the wine's getting to me. So, um, we're going to get that sleep right now. Well met, Traveler. Well met. If it's and hold What her? could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? And who among us could possibly hold that honor? And such power? Well, I think that's me, but we're not going to get into that discussion. It's like a room, sure please. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'm just going to need it for a night. I'll show you to your room. Right no, I way. remember where it's at. Oh, now to get that rest. And we're doing 12 hours. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Uh, nothing, thank you. Okay, let's look at the map. Now. Depending whether or not there is a carriage it looks like I have two routes I can go around the base of the mountain this way and it looks like come up some foothills this way or I can travel through Riverwood which I know I can take a carriage uh, I can travel to Helgen by carriage, I believe. I will have to check that out. And then take this route down through and go here. Or I do know the carriage takes me to Capitals. So I could go to Riften and... Go get this artifact for Orion for the museum. Well, we will make that decision in the next episode. Y'all have a great day. Bye.